thought is biting the hand. Biting the hand humor can come in. <clears throat> For example, if you're annoyed about, annoyed about something at work, you might rather sarcastically say something about your boss even though he pays your paycheck and even though that said paycheck then helps you buy food, clothing, and shelter, etc, etc. But it's mostly meant to be a joke. A little poke poke. Poke poke. Well, I saw one of my favorite examples today. And this is literally in the news. Well, sort of. YouTube a lot of people talk about the bots that do the censoring and the uh are you sure this is appropriate and making sure that no one steals anything copyrightable i i tight i'm so sorry anyway so YouTube does this and sometimes like in a large majority of cases they get it wrong. Okay, so a recent tweet by NBC, uh, an affi uh, NBC affiliate in Florida uh, showcases just how very, very silly this can get. Uh, there was a news story regarding an alligator in a residential neighborhood and it was under a car and so on and so forth. Well, the thumbnail involved said alligator and the algorithm pointed him out as lewd. That gator was lewd. So it got taken down and NBC was like, what the heck? So they sent the following tweet. Hey, YouTube, would you like us to put the gator in pants? Because literally, he is the only person in this that is not wearing clothes. Because now, I love it. It is just weird enough that it makes my little heart happy. Also, I would like to figure out this question I now have regarding gators and pants. One, do you mean the American version of pants or the British version? The former is overwear. You know, what you wear over your lower half so that you don't get arrested or chilly because if there's one thing that's worse than being extremely warm it's having a chilly bum also so or do you mean trousers or do you mean the uk version of pants which is undercrackers the things that go on under the pants that you wear on the outside. Second, how would said Mr. Gator wear said trousers? I mean, I am assuming that he, if it's a boy, he, or even if she's a girl, would need some room for alligator appendages. For example, would you make a hole in the bum so that you could stick their tail through like you would do on a doggy diaper? Do you, you know, put it just over their legs? Do you maneuver it so that the tail comes out through the bottom of the trouser? And if so, wouldn't that be a little bit uncomfortable having it dragging near their feet? So I guess I'm presuming that you have a special pant pocket for the tail. I mean, I've heard now that they have special boxers where there's 
a pocket for all the googly bits, so I mean, I presume that this is possible. Sheath, get back to me. This video not sponsored by Sheath Underwear. Although I am curious, even though, but just in their feminine line because I don't have the stuff for their male line. Anyway, now, what color, I mean, you'd want something that would go well with the green and brown. You would also want something that would be water resistant, perhaps closely knit, to enable the trouser to stay dry instead of getting waterlogged. And what style? Uh, would an alligator enjoy culottes? Would they want gaucho pants, which are basically a longer form of the culotte? I almost said gazpacho pants, but gazpacho is a cold soup, and that doesn't seem comfortable. But now I know why everyone, now I know why when I was talking about gaucho pants, why they started laughing because I think I actually made the gazpacho gaucho mistake. So anyway, here we are. If any of you has any idea or would like to give an artistic representation, please do so. I will be thrilled. And uh, here's to naked alligators and biting the hand. Love you.